Hey guys, a uh, quick update. This is our second day on our trip to central, southern part of Ukraine. Uh, yesterday we were in Vinnytsia. There's a Kavi chapel there and I uh, had a great time with the fellowship and other people that came that heard about the event. Um, and uh, then drove six hours to Svitlovodsk and they've been... Uh, yeah, they've been wanting us to come for a while now to do a worship night. And um, so that's where we are now. We did that this evening and it was a really, really cool time, really joyful time. And uh, also people from the church and then people from other churches came. And in both places, people have just said how important this is and how they have really needed this uh, time of just refreshment and rest. So we're just happy to be a part of that. Um, yeah, so tomorrow I'm preaching here and going to lead worship. And then on Monday we head to Zaporizhia. And so a couple of prayer requests, uh, right off the bat here. Zaporizhia is kind of the, the place I've, I'm most kind of concerned about. Just, um, you know, uh, they, you know, they have air, air raid sirens all the time and, um, they're within range of, you know, uh, a lot of the artillery stuff. Uh, so the city gets hit more often than you know other places um so a bit nervous about Zaporizhia so just pray for our safety pray for peace um this is an event we were invited to several months ago by um some uh, baptists that are doing a youth event and excited to do that really want to serve the people there you know like you can tell as you go further east life is is different um than where we are in western ukraine and it's a little more intense um and uh yeah and more military presence and everything um but uh kind of ironically as we're you know concerned about missile strikes in Zaporizhia, just a few minutes ago we um saw in our uh, you know groups that Chernobyl was hit twice for the first time uh, since the war started with missile strikes so uh, we don't know a whole lot of details yet uh, it doesn't um yeah just it's kind of shaking everybody up but um just strange as we've come east um that, that's happened in western ukraine so just pray for um peace pray for our safety for um people back home and uh, for the rest of our trip uh, we're actually going to, uh, also, we added a, a day to where we're going to be in in Kiev and doing a worship night as well. So we'll kind of keep you updated on things as we go here. Um, really appreciate your prayers. Uh, and uh, yeah, we'll stay in touch.